I asked you a lot about scaling up and you, you talked to me a little bit about a, a project you had done around your EHR, uh, a significant upgrade prior to, to COVID. What was the upgrade about? And, uh, you know, just share a little bit with our audience what the upgrade was about and what were you trying to accomplish? Sure. So, you know, as, as you know, and I think, I think COVID is, is going to be a paradigm shift where we do business differently. With the same token, we were a little lucky. We started doing our upgrade on EHR hardware a little earlier to make sure that the scalability is in place. Uh, in order to do that scalability and upgrade, we upgrade the backend storage to the fastest storage possible that, that is currently available, NVMe RAM. And then we did a very, very fast interconnect to brand new front end servers. So our capacity, uh, it, we used to run between 75 to 80%. Now we are down to 20 to 25%. Now we are at a place where we can scale for next three to five years without any issues, any kind of different variants that comes our way, we are really ready to, to take that head on and have that scalability put in. One thing that is extremely, extremely important, we got the new servers that have AI built in for specialized EHR workloads. So we are ahead of the curve in order to make sure that if there's any peaks that come our way, we can smoothly have that, that scalability built in. So we're seeing AI come all the way down into the architecture, into the, into the core architecture? Absolutely. So, so this AI is especially made for uh, a special workloads. It's customized to a particular workload. And if you use that logic of, of artificial intelligence, you can deliver much better uh, performance with a lower resources. So it's, it's, it's very specialized artificial intelligence built in. So uh, what did you end up doing on the storage side and on the compute? And you also, you also changed the channels as well, right? Absolutely. So we, we upgrade the, the back end to, like I said, NVMe RAM. The front end runs our power, power nines that has the AI built in. And of course, the interconnect were upgraded to 32 gig times. We have eight or, or 10 different strands. So it, it, it's, it's smoking fast. I don't think you can do any faster than that. 